punctuated, of course, by Sunday's Heritage Classic at Commonwealth. Fox to Lindgren, takes it hard to the hole. Save Stewart Skinner, rebound loose and shot wide. In the mix, Panarin rifles a pass through Lafreniere and punched out. Zach Hyman attacking. Heedle back, trying to center him. Philip Heedle channeling his inner defenseman. Turned it over, quick chance. And he shot up the side of the net from Warren Fogel and pulled back by Jonathan Quinn. Brown thought there might have been a trip on dry subtle. None for coming. Shot in by Fox and he got buried by Kane. As he swept that in, thrown in front. Skinner back to our play. Taco could not find Kreider. Blocker to the half wall by Skinner and Ryan a clear to the activating Brett Kulak. On his backhand, rid behind him, that beautiful pass and a backhander stopped by Quick through a screen against Leon Dreisaitl. Minute to go in the period. Troop off the right hand side. And Mark back to the room. Lafreniere on the attack. Sickles puts her west Stewart Skinner flashing out the right pad. Two on one. Here's Gooley. Little chip off the wall. Is that home? Aggressively going down, trying to keep that play alive in the last minute. Three of the last four meetings, a team leading by three goals has actually lost the hockey game. Well, in that first period, we built up the firework aspect of this, Louie, but shot suppression at a premium for both hockey clubs. Soft chip came back to him on a deflection. An error. Peering inside, out to Fox. One timer's advantage out of the club save and hit by Skinner. So he's got to reach back after extending from left to right, and he flashes the oh. goal. Flat tipped away by Kula. Fox over to Zabanajet. Across to Panera. Shadowed by Connor Brown. Inside Trocek. One timer score. Beautiful feed across. And the directional placement that time upstairs from Adam Fox. He guided that one in, yep. Louie, and it's Absolutely. one nothing. The shot, sorry, it's how you get it to the net, but this pass is a beauty across. It's one back, one touch pass. You can see for Fox, he was waiting for this chance opportunity. And look at it, it's a wide open net. He knows Skinner's going to come across. He knows he has to elevate it, so he takes a little off of it to make sure he elevates. Stick to side by Jonathan Quick, and the Rangers are away. Here's a over went down, and Skinner made a glove save on Lafreniere, who tried to go upstairs on him. The Oilers look to go to work on the four check. Nurse beats his man on the pop, Kako. McLeod, left point, shot, save, man. quick rebound, another stop, quick point blank. Gulak angles off the boards, Nugent Hopkins to Hyman. Takes it hard behind the goal, backhand reference, save, quick, and the rebound covered as Kulak came busting down the seam. Adam Fox up the center. Sends the others back, Holloway with a clear. Fox. Off to Jimmy BC. Rangers stay on side. Schneider reach got score. Two nothing. They'll take a look at it, but I think that was called correctly at live speed. I don't know whether you had a better look, Louis. It was I'm very close. Into the play, and here it is. Here is this puck in the neutral zone. You can see Goodrow trying to get off the bench. His feet are off the ice. So yeah. He's fine there, nice pass across, and the defender once again coming right down Main Street. I mean, this is a pick corner by Schneider. So he kind of goes across the grain. And this is it right here. Oh boy, that was really, really close. Maybe you want to look at that at a different angle. I mean, this is right on it. But another perfect shot through a defender that's going down trying to block it. And he picks the far side on Stuart Skinner. We talked to Schneider this morning. It's hard to tell on that play whether or not it comes all the way out, but he buries it. The Rangers have given up only one third period goal all year. Trocek to Wheeler. Fires off the post. Rebound. Stayed out. During his tenure in Winnipeg, seven consecutive 20 goal seasons for Blake Wheeler. Fox kept busting down the seats and again with a backhander denied by Skinner. Two and a half to go in the period. Gustafson. Twirls it back. Savanajad. Schneider. Savanajad. What time off the post? That's two posts. And that one went off the inside of the post. And the Oilers perhaps fortunate not to be further behind at this juncture. 
Rangers looking for more every shift up the ice. They're creating those chances. Great east to west pass. And a one timer by Zibanejad, the shooting mentality. And he ripped that one. He was ready to shoot it. Good pass by Schneider. And they've done a good job to move around the box of Edmonton in front of the goaltender. And Aaron, one timer score. Threading it through, and Lafreniere buries it for a 3 0 lead. And that's four straight games against Edmonton that Lafreniere has scored. You can see the reaction of Stuart Skinner. He's moving from post to post on all of these chances. And one finally goes through is this blast by Lafreniere. And guess who? The bread man, who's really started to find that puck on a string in the offensive zone. Allowing those guys to thrive as they get into their third, fourth, and fifth seasons. Yep, elevating them up the lineup, giving them more of a responsibility, more ice time, and wide-ranging Vinny Dernay able to eat that puck up, and now briskly moving it forward. Dropping it for Hyman. Heading for the net! Shot! And that might have ticked the post. Quick able to cover. A lot of traffic in front of Jonathan Quick on that one. AC unable to hack it out. Vogel inside, one save, quick point blank. And again, Connor Brown victimized. McLeod on the ice. Wins the face off. Great shot off quick. And Matias Echo shoveled back behind the net for Brown. You can see that cross check coming and crumble them in the power play for the Rangers. Panera, Savannah Jack, Panera, wrist shot, save skinner. Another interior pass. The Rangers able to get on top of it. DC with Vogel keeping it alive. Threw it in front. Brown open. Down Jonathan Quick. A second time in this period. Excellent work here by both McLeod in the first battle. The backtracking by Vogel. Strip the puck. Get it into the middle. And Hyman has a real good look. He tries to go glove. And the grizzled veteran denies it. Flat. Kulak. Hard up the right hand side. The Rangers break it up. Cooley has a man. It's Wheeler in on net. Puts the brakes on. Feathered it back, and it was deflected home by Cooley for his second. The Oilers feel like this may have been kicked in. One in the neutral zone turns the puck over. Cooley gets it to Wheeler. Good job by Ekholm to close and deny the chance, but then throws it into the middle. And as he's going, oh yeah, there That's it is. There it goes off the skate. I don't think that's a kick. I don't know if that's either. a kicking motion or just a stopping. Good goal. I think that's the right goal. I mean, it's a little bit of a back kick. It's almost a soccer play through your legs, but not a forward motion. I mean, he's got his back to the net by the time it does go in. It'll be Cooley from Wheeler. They might actually take a longer look at this one because there was some motion towards the net with the foot. After video review, it was determined the puck was kicked into there the net. Go. We have no goal. There you go. Wow. Schneider disrupts the cycle. Heedle trying to melt the remaining time, and he will with help from Panarin. And it's a shutout for Jonathan Quick. 29 stops, and the Rangers score all three of their goals in the second period to win going away.